Faha, hi, this is Lex here once again for another episode of WMTV's Weekly News. Let's start with upcoming events. On Friday, May 3rd, we will be having a blood drive, not just any blood drive. It's the 2019 high Westville High School versus Circleville High School blood battle. To schedule an appointment, you can see an NHS member or you can sign up during lunch. If you are eligible, please sign up. We can save lives and keep our name on the trophy all at the same time. Also, NHS is accepting donations during third period for the 2019 Westville High School Animal Shelter Drive. Items include paper towels, cat and dog treats, cat and dog toys, collars and leashes, cat and dog food, and much more. Any related pet donations are welcome. The third period class with the most donations will win donuts and hot chocolate. The student lists for honor night are posted outside the guidance office. Please check your list for correct spelling and see if your name is on the list. If it's not on the list and you believe it should be on the list, make sure you go and see Miss Paula in the guidance office. This week is prom week. Thursday, tomorrow is beach day, and Friday is frat day. Make sure you participate for the 2019 prom. Now let's send it to Tolly for sports. Thanks, Lexi. The spring sports season has just started and we got a lot to read off, so let's do this. We have track first. Uh, Marcus Whaley won the 110 hurdles, 300 hurdles in pole vault. Charles Flender got second in the 110 meter hurdles. Ashley Hegarty got first in high jump. Olivia Barnes placed fifth in the mile, and Abby Ogle placed 11th in the mile. Congratulations to everybody. Softball won against Zane Trace and Warren. Congratulations to Elizabeth Stonerock and Marcy Dudgeon got a home run. Woo! Next, congratulations to Malin Conrad, Jacob Hawks, Dory Welch, Tyler Adams, Grace Picklesheimer, Brooke Sweeney, and Sylvia Beltran for competing in the State Dairy Contest. Uh, special congratulations to Malin for placing fifth, and he is going to the Eastern Region Contest in the fall. Good luck, Malin. And next up, congratulations to Justin Schoblock, Jacob Hawks, and Cody Thompson for being accepted to play the in the Macy's Day Parade. Look out for them on TV. See you there. Finally, to wrap it up, we have Battle Over Bucks placing first and third. Congratulations. And Mr. Smith has just been uh, put as the new head coach of the football team. So, Smith, hope you have a great season. Back to you, Lexi. Congratulations to Justin Schoblock, Jacob Hox, and Cody Thompson for being accepted to play the Macy's Great American Marching Band at the Macy's Day Parade. Congratulations to West Falls Battle Over Books teams for placing first and third. And also congratulations to the softball team for beating Warren 7-1. Special congratulations to Marcy Dungeon for getting the win on the mound and hitting her first home run. Elizabeth Stonerock also hit a home run. Congratulations, ladies. Congratulations to Maylin Conrad, Jacob Hawks, Doria Welch, Tyler Adams, Grace Picklesheimer, Brooke Sweeney, and Sylvia Beltran-Rosales for competing in the state dairy contest. Special congratulations to Malin Conrad for placing fifth and qualifying for the Eastern Region Contest in the fall. Good luck. There's only three days till prom, everyone. Three. Anyway, this has been WMTV's Weekly News for the week of April 3rd. Once again, I'm Lexi reminding you that as the Westwell way, we are better than average, and as always, hashtag stronger together. This is a public service announcement. Avengers Endgame is coming out April 26th. Buy your tickets soon. There's showtimes available on the AMC website and or the AMC app on mobile. It'll be a good one. So what else? I don't know. I like your shoes. Back to you, Lexi. Thanks, man. Hey. Bye. Night, I'm so glad that I'm not going to tell about it. I can do whatever you want with it. The schedule was busy, my head in a hoodie, my shorty a goodie, my cousins are crazy, my cousins like boogie. Life is amazing, it is what it should be. Would you rather have a very painful toothache or the worst headache? Yeah, I picked the worst headache. Worst headache. 
Would you rather like always get diarrhea or always get constipated? Constipated. <laughs> Would you rather have all the gold in the world or have all the knowledge in the world? Mm, knowledge. Would you rather get away with lying or always know when someone's lying? Always know when someone's lying. Would you rather be extremely underweight or extremely overweight? I have no clue for that one. <laughs> Would you rather have a very painful toothache or the worst headache? The worst headache. Would you rather always get diarrhea or always constipation? <laughs> <laughs> diarrhea. Would you rather get all the gold in the world or all the knowledge in the world? Knowledge. Would you rather always get away with lying or always know when someone's lying? Oh, that's hard. Know when someone's lying. Would you rather be extremely underweight or extremely overweight? Uh, overweight. Fat, sassy, and happy. Oh, yeah. Yes. Would you rather have a very painful toothache or the worst headache? Toothache. Would you rather always get diarrhea or always get constipated? I don't know, constipated? I don't know. <laughs> Would you rather have all the gold in the world or all the knowledge in the world? Gold? Would you rather always get away with lying or always know when someone's lying? No, when someone's lying. Would you rather be extremely underweight or extremely overweight? Underweight. Sweet. Would you rather have a very, very painful toothache or the worst headache? A toothache, all nine. Well, Headache, because a toothache could cause a headache. <laughs> so yeah, I go with the headache. <laughs> Would you rather always get diarrhea or always get constipated? Ooh, that's a tough one. Probably diarrhea. Would you rather have all the gold in the world or all the knowledge? All the knowledge for sure, because then I could just get all the gold after I had all the knowledge. Would you rather get away with lying or always know when someone's lying? Get away with it. Would you rather be extremely underweight or extremely overweight? Under, for sure. Would you rather have a very painful toothache or the worst headache? Um, I'm thinking the worst headache. Would you rather always get diarrhea or always get constipated? I think always get diarrhea. Would you rather have all the gold in the world or all the knowledge in the world? I'm thinking all the gold in the world. <laughs> Would you rather always get away with lying or always know when someone's lying? Uh, always know when someone's lying. Would you rather be extremely underweight or extremely overweight? <sighs> extremely overweight. Thanks.